Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, obviously we're doing something a little bit different today. Um, I'm actually going to be reviewing a charcoal face mask for you guys on camera. And I'm really, really excited about this because the company actually reached out to me and asked me if I would like to review their face mask for them. Um, face masks are definitely up my alley and I love charcoal face masks, so I definitely agreed. Uh, so they did send me this product for review and I cannot wait to test it out, good or bad. <laughs> So we will find out together. So before we get started, if you guys are not subscribed, please go ahead and hit that button down below. Uh, you can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter, and I'll have those linked down below for you as well. Okay, so here is the packaging right here. On the front, it says Natural Rapids. That's the, uh, that's the brand. It's a charcoal clay healing mask, active luxury facial, made with all natural ingredients and organic ingredients. Um, so this is supposed to be organic ingredients, sulfate free, not tested on animals. That's awesome. Uh, paraben free. It does give you a list of ingredients on the back. Uh, it says it's organic benite clay, organic activated charcoal, organic thymus vulgaris, uh, leaf extract, um, directions. Mix one teaspoon of the mask. Oh, okay. So we are mixing this bad boy. <laughs> I've never had to do that before. So, okay. Mix one teaspoon of the mask with one teaspoon of raw apple cider vinegar. I don't have that okay water or aloe vera juice in a bowl and mix well add more mask or liquid as needed apply to skin and let dry for about five to ten minutes for sensitive skin and 10 to 15 minutes for normal skin remove the mask by thoroughly rinsing your face with warm water a pulsating and tightening feeling as well as slight redness of the skin is normal uh, it will disappear in about 30 minutes use the mask once per week for external use only Caution, only use as directed, keep out of range of children, avoid eye contact, discontinue if use if irritation occurs. I mean, that's the standard caution. Um, okay, so let's see. So this is what it looks like. Just a little white container. Um, it is a nice size container. I will say this irritates me no matter what brand does this, whether it's ABH or, you know, if it was a Jeffree Star product or even this product, when, <laughs> when the stickers don't line up and it just kind of is slapped on there, that irritates me just because of the fact that I'm <sighs> a perfectionist. <laughs> Um, but I do like the color of the sticker. I think that's really eye-catching. The white and the pink look really nice together. So uh, once again, on the bottle, it does have the directions, so you don't have to keep the box. I really, really like that. Um, and of course, it has the ingredients listed on the other side and the fact that it's not tested on animals. And this product is also made in the USA, which I think is fantastic. So I do like the fact that it still has all that information on the bottle. I think that is really, really important um, because we don't want to have to keep a whole bunch of packaging all the time <laughs> so of course I open this up and it is completely sealed so what I'm gonna go do is I'm gonna go ahead and grab I guess um, I don't have any measuring cups so I'm gonna just gonna have to do this a little bit by eye I'm gonna go grab a cup of water a bowl and a spoon and I'll be right back okay so I am back so I just grabbed a little bowl that I have a spoon to kind of scoop everything out with and one of my kids uh, lovely Batman cup with water so um, like I said I don't have a measuring cup uh, it says to do like a teaspoon we're just gonna kind of judge this by eye I've never mixed a product before so I'm not really sure how this is gonna go if it works and it's not worth the tr and it, it's not like a whole hassle then I'm totally down for it but we will see so I just opened this up I don't want to tilt it too much because it will fall out so it's like a gray powder because it is a charcoal mask no direct smell to it so that's really nice so we're just gonna do like one little spoonful it is really finely milled so you could definitely get a lot of use out of this. This is actually four ounces. Okay. I feel like a chemist. <laughs> I don't want to put too much water in there. I mean, if I did, I could always add a little bit more of the, the product itself. 
So there's three different options that you could do. Like I said, you could do water, which I'm doing because obviously I don't have the other two. I think the one was the apple cider vinegar. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need way more water than that. Okay. Okay, this is not, it's clumping up, which I don't know why. Maybe I don't have a, why is it clumping up? Maybe I should add a little bit more powder. All right, there we go. Definitely have to find the right mixture of water and um, the powder itself. I'm sorry, I wish you guys could like kind of see this, but see some of the clumps are still in there. So I gotta really work those out. Okay, you know what, this is gonna take a minute. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this. I'm so sorry guys, um, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I played with the formula just a little bit between you know adding a little powder, adding a little water, considering I don't have a measuring cup. Um, I think I got the consistency pretty much down. I do like the fact, I don't even know if you can tell on camera, um, but it does have a consistency that I would get out of a tube uh, for a charcoal mask. So mixing it hasn't become an issue so far other than just making sure you got the right consistency together. Um, so now that that is done, I do need to apply it. There is no smell to it. I literally smell nothing. So that's actually really good. I know strong scents can really turn people off. Now hopefully I have made enough <laughs> for my whole face um, since I got the consistency right I, I wanted to go ahead and stop adding to it so um, this is gonna be weird because I'm gonna apply this with the spoon since it's already covered now I did use like my little uh, spatula to kind of help get some of the clumps out um, so definitely use something flat I wouldn't necessarily go with a spoon that was kind of a mistake on my part Ooh, that's cold I like it don't worry guys, I'm not gonna use the whole the spoon the whole time. I am gonna spray, <laughs> spray around my fingers. I just wanted to get like a just of it on my face. Mm. Mm. Football player, right? Ah! Well, too late now that I did my whole face, but look at it. Smelly face, mustache. Okay, I'll stop playing for real. All right. Oh yeah, I like the consistency of it. Definitely feels like other charcoal masks that I have used before, so that's really nice. Oh, I made way too much. A little bit goes a long way, guys. You will have to say this is hard to put on with no mirror in front of me. Oh yeah, look, I've wasted way so much. Look at this, I have so much left because I thought, um, I don't know what I thought, but whew. just remember if you do decide to get this product that a little bit goes a very, very long way. Bring it down a little bit. Try not to get all up in my baby hairs. Alright, I'd say that's about it. I'd say that's good. Oh yeah, okay. 
<laughs> I'm gonna go wash my fingers. Obviously, I still had whole extra face of product left um so like i said a little bit goes a long way so i'm going to go wash my fingers and then we'll start reading some of the um the claims on the website okay so i am back i can say i already feel it starting to tighten it feels really good on the face um i didn't use any kind of special cold water i just used normal temperature water um but it just it has a really nice cooling effect i'm totally digging this um, so I am going to leave this on. I said for sensitive skin, it's 10, 5 to 10, and the other one's 10 to 15. We're going to do 10 minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and set my alarm. I know it's been a few minutes already. Um, hey Siri, set a timer for 10 minutes. Your timer is set for 10 minutes. Hey. Okay. Like I said, this product is off of Amazon. It's Natural Rapids. It says it's Indian Healing Clay with Charcoal Face Mask. Best for blackheads and acne treatment. Uh, calcium Bentonite Clay Mask, Facial Cleanser, Blackhead Remover, and Pore Minimizer. I have a lot of pores, so this is going to be really awesome. So it says, what's our secret? The answer is all about natural ingredients that are backed by science. Our charcoal Indian healing clay features a unique, unique formulation that combines the incredible benefits of activated charcoal with the amazing power of Ben Knight clay. Uh, these ingredients are proven to prevent and eliminate acne, remove blackheads, rejuvenate skin, and minimize pores. By combining the most powerful ingredients for healthy skin, we've created the ultimate long-term solution to keeping your skin healthy and beautiful. Features and details. It says it's revolutionary. Our Indi Indian healing clay is combined with incredible cleansing power of charcoal, which will leave you with clean and beautiful skin. It's made with all natural and organic ingredients, which deliver the key to clear, beautiful skin for women and men without feeling like you're peeling industrial glue off your face. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, minimize pores. In addition to purifying and removing skin clogs, our cleansing mask minimizes the pores of your, the look of your pores and removes toxins and purities located deep in the skin. Uh, this is supposed to be working for all skin types. It can controls blemishes and keep your head, face, nose clean. Works for oily, dry, sensitive, and normal skin. Um, it also says it's uncommon because of the benite clay helps with cystic acne. Um, and scar removal through skin suction and tightening. This means that the mask can help heal those ice pick scars that are being caused by or left over from acne. So those are some really awesome claims. We will see what my face looks afterwards. So I got my timer on. So now I guess it's just time for a dance party. Okay, so I just want to do a quick check-in because this face mask is not dry. Um, I can definitely feel the tingliness that they were talking about a little bit in right here. Um, it's nothing that is uncomfortable, um, maybe a little bit itchy, but it definitely feels like it's doing its job. So with that being said, I'll be back again.
Okay, so I was going to do 10 minutes, but it wasn't completely dry. So now I'm at the 15 minute mark. Um, I possibly could have done way too much right around here and here because uh, you can see that it has dried up on the other spots, but it's definitely breaking apart. So I'm going to go ahead and still wash this off because it has been time. Uh, the max time that the instruction said was 15 minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and wash this all off and we shall see what is underneath. Okay, so I am back. Um, I definitely have some redness, not everywhere, just mostly in my sensitive areas, like right here. I did bring it down kind of low on my neck. A little bit of redness here, tiny, tiny bit here, um, and a little bit of redness here. It doesn't hurt, it doesn't burn. My skin feels really, really smooth. All right, let's take a closer look at these pores. Let me clean my mirror. Okay, so, oh, okay. Got a little bit stuck right there. Oh yeah, it definitely cleaned my nose. I definitely minimized some pores on my nose Oh yeah, definitely. Up here, my pores look a lot smaller. Um, usually they're big in your face, like, oh my gosh, it's really, really bad. Um, but they look actually a lot, <laughs> wow, okay. They look a lot smaller than they normally do. That is awesome, wow. I do love how my face feels right now. It just feels like really, tight but not in a bad way like a fresh face and really really smooth so uh yeah and washing it off i did not have any issues at all um with warm water it just it came off so easily um so i know some charcoal mask i do have a little bit of a difficult time i kind of have to like scrub back and forth just to get it to budge um even in the driest parts on my face i did not have that issue it just came right off and that was actually really nice i definitely see myself using this product in the future i just i can't get over how good my skin looks minus the red because they said it could take up to 30 minutes for the redness to go away but you guys my face looks and feels really nice i am very very impressed um <laughs> So like I said, this product is on Amazon. It is $15.99 for four ounces. And as you saw, a little bit goes a very long way. So this is gonna last you a good while. I think this is a great value. I love the results that I'm getting. Um, I did leave it on the, for the 15 minutes, so that's why I started getting the, the heavy tingle, tingleness. Um, it didn't hurt, it didn't burn. It just got a little itchy for me because every time my face tingles like that, my face feels itchy. Um, but that's just me. That's not, that does not mean it's going to happen to you. Okay. So let's talk about this. First of all, even just sitting here, as I continue to sit here, my face, I just, I cannot get over how good my face feels. Um, it's definitely up there with my, um, my origins charcoal face mask. I feel about the same as or after I've used it. It just feels refreshed and smooth and my pores are small and I love that feeling. So this is definitely right up there with my origins. Now you can order this off of Amazon for $15.99. Um, I think that is a great price because as you guys saw a little bit goes a long way. Like I honestly used way too much. Um, I mean it was trial and error with the first time and having to mix it. That part is a little bit on the downside but I think once you get get um, the proper amount and kind of see how it works then I don't think it's going to be a problem in the future it's trial and error the very first time that you do it especially if you've never mixed a product before um, which I have not so that was definitely interesting for me and kind of fun at the same time because you know just playing with some ingredients <laughs> it was it was fun um, the packaging it definitely it's a nice tight seal so the powder is not going to get everywhere um, let's talk about the powder I love the fact that this product has 
no scent. So um, mixing it, it doesn't smell like anything. Putting it on your face, it does not smell like anything. Um, I think that is a huge plus. That's going to be a huge plus for a lot of people because there are some people that are really sensitive to smells. Um, so that is something that you do not have to worry about with this. I mean, it's made in the USA, not tested on animals. I just think this is a great product. I'm really excited to be able to try this out. I was a little unsure of how it was going to go. Um, of course, it's a product I've never heard of, product, product I haven't tried before. Um, but I'm always going to be 100% honest with you guys, no matter what. And I still, I think this ended up being a really great product. So kudos to Natural Rapids. I am really, really happy with this. Now they did give me a code so you guys can save 10%. Um, I will leave this code right here and also in the description box along with a link so you guys can be so you guys can click that link and it will take you straight over uh, to the website so you can make your purchase. But you guys, I think you really should try this. Um, I don't think you're going to be disappointed. If you do have that sensitive skin that I was mentioning, I would not leave it on for the full 10 minutes. I would maybe do a thin layer and do like a five minute trial um, just to see kind of where you stand. But yeah, <laughs> yes, I don't. I, oh, wow. awesome and see all my redness is actually already starting to, to fade away so that's super exciting all right guys so that is it for this review i hope you found it enjoyable and helpful and um a little bit silly <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye